Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to share with you Exoterra Massive Cell up to 40%. Do you want to find out more? Let's watch the whole video. To be eligible for the cells, all you have to do is watch the full video for the items code. Guys, I'll be taking over from now onwards. I'll start off with this Aztec Warrior Eagle Hide. So you can see this one is very nice. This is quite limited actually. It's actually a hide for your animals to go in. Acts like a cave also. Very nice item. So let me show your details. Go now. Okay. Let me just get the tag for you guys to see. Here we go. So this one is the Aztec Warrior Hide. Item code EP2698. So if you guys are interested in getting this item, just let us know the item code. Okay, girl. Can you please move? Move. Yeah. I repeat, item code EP2698. Okay, moving on to the next item. Next item will be the Aztec calendar height. Show you the details. This one. This is actually one of the newest items by Exoterra. Very nice height, suitable for your geckos, tarantula, scorpions. If you want, you can combo together with this Aztec Warrior as well. Aztec Calendar. Let me check the code for this item. Aztec Calendar. Alright, the item code for this Aztec Calendar is EP2697. EP2697. Next item, Aztec frog dish. Very nice frog dish. Very cool looking. You can use this as a water dish or football. It's up to you. Can be used for anything actually. You can actually use them just for decor itself. Doesn't matter. Aztec Warrior Item code Aztec Frog EP2699 EP2699 This is how they look like put together Very nice isn't it? Now Aztec Water Dish This is the size Very nice Aztec Water Dish This item is very good because it's very heavy so it wouldn't tilt easily. Very good to use for tarantulas uh, terrarium. Very nice detail. So Aztec water dish item code. Aztec water dish item code EP2678 EP2678 Next item, terrarium, Aztec terrarium mini tall. Size 12 by 12 by 18 inches, 18 inches tall. Show you guys the background, very limited Aztec background, very nice isn't it? Okay, this one Aztec terrarium, very suitable for geckos. Tarantula, arboreal species like P. metallica or any tree dwelling tarantulas, geckos um, like um, crested gecko, scorpions. Actually, you can just put anything you like. 
So item code for this one is Aztec Terrarium 12 inch by 12 inch by 18 inch EP 2700 Item code for this item is EP 2700 Aztec Terrarium Small the next item also an Aztec terrarium but this one is slightly larger than the other one this one is small tall you can design it like this very nice the warrior eagle the Aztec water dish add some bronze inside will be very nice already this one the size is let me show you the background first it's the same background as the other one just that this one is bigger way bigger so this one the item code is 2799 EP 2799 okay I'll show you the Aztec terrarium side by side two sizes side by side that's the smaller one on top of the slightly bigger one so remember the item code and if you like this item and you want to get it do visit us at evermore pets kuching okay let's move on to the next item okay i'll show you the aztec terrarium side by side two sizes side by side that's the smaller one on top of the slightly bigger one so remember the item code and if you like this item and you want to get it do visit us at evermore pets kuching okay let's move on to the next item this one is a standard mini tall terrarium item size is 12 by 12 by 18 inches tall comes with the standard Exoterra rock background, 3D rock background so if you don't want anything special just like the Aztec, Tiki or any limited edition you can go for this one this one is just the standard Exoterra mini tall terrarium this one is very suitable for small geckos small arboreal geckos um, small to medium size arboreal species tarantula arboreal tarantula species such as p metallica pink toe any avicularia species will go inside here pretty good all you need to do is just add on substrate height such as um, cork bark we have cork bark also if you want but unfortunately for cork bark we don't have any promotion for now if you want them interested, you can visit us at Evermore Pets Kuching. So let me get the item code for this item. Okay. Exoterra Standard Terrarium Mini Tall. 12 by 12 by 18 inches. Item code. EP8721 EP8721 one the next item is medium low terrarium this one the size is 24 inch by 18 inch by 12 inch here you go this terrarium is actually very very suitable for beginners who started keeping exotic pets such as Sukata tortoise, baby Sukata tortoise, baby bearded dragons, baby cherry head tortoise, baby leopard tortoise, and any other small tortoise. I know that Sukata can grow really large when they're adults, but this item is suitable only for babies. So for babies, no problem. If you want to find out more about Exoterra terrariums, you haven't used them before, you want to know the features, how to use them, what special features they have, how to add on lighting, 
the ventilation system you can come to Evermore Pets come and find me I will tell you everything you need to know you don't have to buy anything you can just come and see no problem medium low 24 by 18 by 12 terrarium item called EP2 sorry EP8635 I repeat EP8635 so we also have the whole set here show you guys everything whole set starter kit very suitable for those who just bought their first pet like bearded dragon baby bearded dragons baby sukata baby leopard tortoise this is actually very worth it because we have massive clearance sales right now we seldom have this we seldom have up to 40 percent discount not everything is 40 percent but maximum up to 40 percent discount T-Rex skull very suitable display piece and also height introducing solar glow this is very good all in one you have the UVA, UVB, visual light and heat all in one 1 to 5 watts so if you are using this item you don't need two light domes already you don't need two light domes you only need one because everything is already in one bar if you opt for UVB and heat but separately then you will need to use two reptile dome one dome for UVB and another one for the basking spot these two item is very suitable for bearded dragons as well as sulcata iguana can also use this the reason I like to use uh, the 13 watt UVB 150 is because this is very good for almost all reptiles. I know and some of you guys might know that um, Exoterra have different kinds of UVB bulb, UVB 100, UVB 150 and UVB 200 and it comes with either the 13 watt or the 25 watts but for me I will introduce my customer just to use the 13 watt UVB 150 here is the reason why remember this is just my personal opinion and this has been how I use it for almost 20 years so to me I just go for this one because it's in between UVB 100 is too low for me UVB 200 is too high for me and since this is just UVB the watt is not important for me the watt is only important if it is heat just like the heat lamp if you want something to be hot the higher the wattage the hotter it is but for UVB what is important is the number here UVB 150, 100 or 200 in this case I'm using 150 150 to me is a very good all-rounder I can use the 150 for bearded dragons I can use the 150 for sukata totis leopard totis cherry head totis even the common red ear slider turtle can, terrapin can also use this um, what else iguana of course iguana and also chameleon so all-rounder you don't have to buy so many types you don't have to waste money on so many types you just have to buy one for all because I know throughout this industry um, my customer me myself my friends sometimes when we buy one reptile for example we get a bearded dragon then something go wrong they die or we give them away or we sell them away or we upgrade to another reptile then it may not be suitable for the next one so it's very important when you get something you get something that is suitable for almost any species so that is why I strongly recommend this one 150 so in case if you change from a sukata to a bearded dragon no problem you can still use it in case you change to a chameleon you can still use it so really all-rounder very worth it so I'll review the item code later on stay tuned make sure you watch the full length of this video 
And now I'll go on to talk about this particular item. Intense basking spot. This is um, your typical heat lamp. Okay, heat lamp is obviously to produce heat. Very important for digestion, especially sukata and also bearded dragon. In fact, most reptiles actually, except for nocturnal reptiles. Here's the thing: nocturnal reptiles they only they are only active at night. They don't come out to bask under the sun, so you don't need basking spot. For reptiles that are active during the day, such as bearded dragons, very active during the day, they hunt in the day, they have to be under the sunlight almost all day. So this will be very important for them. 75 watts, also a very all rounder watt. 50 watt, maybe too little. 75 watt, not too high, not too low. Personal preference, this is my recommendation. So if you need more tips, how to take care of your reptiles, reptiles have problem, eye cannot open, watery eyes, flu, respiratory problems, um, no appetite, you can come to Evermore Pets, talk to me, maybe I can help you. So let me move on to the next item here, 50 watts night heat lamp. This one, a lot of people ask me, do I need night lamp? So every time my customer come to Evermore Pets, they say, Benson, do I need night lamp? 我需要 night lamp ma. Peluka saya guna heat lamp bagi night lamp nya. Waktu malam. Should I use heat lamp? So, here's my opinion, guys. Heat lamp. To me, we are living in a tropical country, Malaysia. Borneo, very humid and already very hot. So to me, naturally in the wild, um, your animals in the wild, in their natural habitat, the temperature will usually go down at night. For example, like Sukata, semi-desert area, like um, bearded dragon from uh, Australian um, wasteland. So these places, at night, temperature drop. So it's natural to have lower temperature at night so in my opinion, you don't really need this one unless, unless you are using air condition. So if you put your reptiles in inside it, an air conditioning room where you set to maybe 18 Celsius, 22 Celsius or anything below 26 Celsius so that you can sleep well at night but your reptile, but you are afraid that your reptile may be too cold then yes, I recommend this one then this is for you. For those who sleep in air conditioned room with their reptiles, Exoterra night heat lamp will be for you. So if you want this item, can't look for me. Ever more pets. So now the next item. Let's see, glow light. Well, this one is almost the same as the reptile dome. The only difference is that this one, the glow light come with a clamp. Okay, a clamp. And another feature is that it glows in the dark after you off the light. Here you go. Here's a comparison. This is when you on it. This is after you off it. The surface glows in the dark creating a very cool moonlight effect. Just like something like this, you see. So for those of you, after you off your light and you stay beside your bed, still want to look at your reptiles ah, what this is very good let me get it in focus yes so moving on to the next item okay next item guys supplements let's talk about supplements so for now we only have the exoterra supplement for reptiles here's the calcium multivitamin and calcium with D3 okay what's the difference for this one calcium only without the vitamin D3 this is for um, um, reptiles that are more sensitive to vitamin D3 or for those of you who already have the UVB so then you don't really need the one with the D3 okay some chameleons are very sensitive to vitamin D3 
too much vitamin D3 may not be good for them. In that case, you use the calcium only. Well, calcium is obviously used for healthy bones and growth. Let's move on. Let me continue with this one. Calcium with D3 now. So, this is basically calcium with the addition of vitamin D3. This is suitable for reptiles that are rapidly growing, such as baby bearded dragons and sukata. They grow very fast in the first year. So you will have to make sure that they have enough vitamin D3 for their calcium, to absorb calcium, so that their bones can grow as fast as their growth, you see. And obviously, for those of you who somehow do not have this UVB bulb, then I'll recommend you supplement with this calcium with D3. Now a lot of people ask me, what is D3? What is vitamin D3? What is the relationship between using a UVB bulb and vitamin D3? Okay, for those of you who just started watching this video right here at this point, I'll recap again. Um, if you want to know any more details, any problem with your pets, you can come to Evermore Pets Coaching and look for me, Benson. I can teach you everything I know. Some of the things I don't know, maybe I can learn from you and we can learn from each other in this hobby. So let me continue. So um, for those who doesn't know this fact, vitamin D3 is very important for any living being. For us humans also the same. We get our vitamin D3 actually from the sun. When our skin is exposed to the sun, it, there is something from the sun which is the UVB that enables our skin to create vitamin D3. So our body absorbs this vitamin D3 so that our body can in turn absorb any calcium from the food that we take. So calcium and D3 is very important. They have to work hand in hand. If you feed your bearded dragons or your sukata calcium, but if they lack vitamin D3, then it's safe to say that a big portion of those calcium probably is not being used by the animal. Hence, you may think, why I got give my animal calcium, but they still get metabolic bone disease. Then you will have to ask yourself, did you supplement with D3 or did you use the UVB hand in hand with the calcium? So you have to use those, these two things together. Very important. So basically to recap, um, your pets need vitamin D3 in order for them to absorb the calcium that you give them. Very simple. Okay, if you need more explanation, well, you know where to look for me. Okay, moving on to the next item now. Don't want to bore you guys with calcium talk. Let's talk about multivitamin instead. So as for multivitamin, not much to talk about. Just like human supplement, we take multivitamins as well. And it's for the overall well-being of your pets. And also for those who want their pets to have nice color, well, multivitamin helps a bit. But do not expect your orange bearded dragon to turn super red, okay? Multivitamin do not help in that aspect because no matter how red you want your bearded dragon to be, how colorful you want that chameleon to be, it all depends on number one, um, the breed. Not really the breed, but the genetic, okay? The genetic. Something that is not genetically super red will never be super red, no matter what vitamin or any supplement that you give. So generally, this is only for health, immune system. Okay, and growth. So let's move on to the next item. This item, standard water dish, small size. Well, I use this for most of my pets. Most of my tarantulas use this as water dish. So this item, let me check. 
Normal Exoterra water dish small size item called EP5690. Let me repeat EP5690. So, if you want this item, come to Evermore Pets. Let me know the item code and you shall have it for a very good discounted price. Clearance sales. Okay, moving on to the next item, we have the Exoterra T Rex skull. This is the large one. So you can see, very cool 3D T-Rex skull. Actually this one, when I first saw this item last time years ago, I didn't get this for my pets, I get it for myself. I just put it in my room as a decoration, that's it. So it's that pretty guys. So I like the space here, very roomy. See, different, different, different sizes of holes here. So this one is actually very, very suitable for um, tarantulas, scorpions. They love to crawl inside holes like this. Even centipede, for those of you who keep centipede, this is also very good. Actually geckos too. So the item cut for this item. This one is very worth it, I can tell you. Because this item normal price is quite expensive. Maybe to some it's not expensive, to some it's expensive, but to me, com I compare this item to any other Exoterra item out there probably because it's um, very nice, that's why the price is a bit higher. So, item cut for this one, T-Rex, let me check. Oh, let me get back to you. This I misplaced, I missed out the item code for this one just now. So, this particular one is EP5928. I repeat, T-Rex Skull by Exoterra, item code EP5928. Okay, let's move on to the next item. Hey guys, so now let's move on to the next item. We have the Exoterra feeding dish. This is a very low feeding dish as you can see. About one inch high only. Here you go. So since it's very low, it's very suitable for tortoise. Very suitable for Indian star tortoise, Sukata, cherry head, leopard tortoise. So this item let me show you the whole size. Ah, this one goes well inside this tank as well. See, just nice. Your tortoise can easily crawl inside, take a bath also. Very nice size, very nice item. So this one, the coat. Feeding dish. Item called EP5688. EP5688 Okay So let me move on to the next item On to the next item we have the water dish XL water dish This one is quite deep About 2 inches deep So this one is not so suitable for your baby sukata or baby tortoises But I'll recommend this one for snakes This one is a very good um, water dish for ball pythons, baby reticulated pythons, corn snake or any other snake. So acts as a water dish as well as a swimming pool if you may like. Your snakes can have a swim inside as well. It helps with good and proper shedding. So this item EP5689 EP5689 We have discount for this item as well Evermore Pets Exoterra clearance sales So if you are interested in any of these item guys You can drop by and say hi But remember to bring along the item code Thank you very much Moving on to the next item This item we have the Crocodile Skull so you have seen the T-Rex skull, now we have the crocodile skull, very nice. 
A lot of my customers mistaken this for a real croc skull actually. So for those of you who have tried the Kuching's um, crocodile meat, this looks familiar. But of course this one is fake, but looks very nice. So this item is also very suitable for um, for height, especially since it's very low. Let me show you. So I will use this for scorpions or centipede because scorpions like it very narrow. So very good height for those um, creepy crawlies. If you are keeping Madagascar roaches, Dubia roaches as pets, or Hissing roaches as pets or any other species, this is also a very good um, height to consider. It's very, very low. So these things like to hide underneath it. So the item code for this one is EP5922. EP5922. Okay, if you're interested, drop by Evermore Pets. Thank you very much. It's now before we move on to the next item, I want to share with you about another thing about these two skulls I missed out just now. Another thing I forgot to mention to you guys is that um, both of these items is sinkable, meaning to say if you drop them inside the aquarium, they will sink to the bottom. So another point to add is that it is actually very suitable for those of you who have aquariums, those of you who keep fish as well. So some of my customers actually use this. Very nice. So let's move on. This next item is the Exoterra Forest Moss. This one is very suitable for frogs, amphibians, um, crocodile skin, um, blue tongue skin, um, snakes, geckos, tar uh, tarantulas. You can actually um, mix this together with the tarantula substrate as well. So it's very good for holding humidity. Each pack contains two blocks, as you can see here, two separate blocks. Okay. It may appear very small, but trust me, once you suck them, they will expand to quite a huge amount actually. So I use this on for all of mine, for most of my terrariums actually. So keep that in mind. Very suitable for most animals. This one, the item code is EP5687. EP5687. All right. Okay, next item are breeding boxes. Here you go, we have two sizes. The small and the medium size. This one is very nice to use on small animals. The best feature for this one is the opening at the side here. So the boxes are stackable. You can put one on top of another. There is a thing here where you can sit them on top without them moving yeah like this let me show you there we go and because of that the side door become very important very useful actually this one each time you want to feed your animals you don't have to remove each box you can just open from the side and drop in your crickets or your roaches very easy to use we have two sizes so these items code are for the breeding box size S we have the item code as EP5685 EP5685 breeding box medium size EP5686 EP5686 okay this item will be the mini white natural terrarium mini white 
12 by 12 by 12 inch this is the one feet cube tank comes with a 3d rock background as well very suitable size for most uh, medium small to medium large tarantulas we have special discount for this item too so just give me the code EP8719 the code for this item is EP8719 so if you are interested just come to Evermore Pets and give me all the item codes thank you very much moving on to the next item okay now let's move on to lighting first we start off with the all-in-one solar glow 125 watts you have it in uva uvb visual light and also heat all in one bulb so this is a very very worth it item very good item so you can use this with the reptile dome the large reptile dome so this is very suitable again for bearded dragons iguana sukata and other tortoises very strong light so the item code for this one is ep1222 ep1222 so next item also a UVB but this one is just standalone UVB bulb okay the item code for this one let me see EP2310 13 watts UVB 150 EP2310 now intense basking spot heat lamp 75 watts item code ep2312 ep2312 guys that's it these are the items for sale now so to be to recap to be eligible for the clearance sales Please don't forget to watch the full length of this video to find out each item's code. You, you need the code to gain the discount. Not only that, you have to subscribe to this channel, like and subscribe to this channel, watch the video to find out each item's code, and that's it. Very easy. Make sure to turn on notification after you have subscribed to this channel, yeah? so in the future if you like all these kind of discounts we will have more it depends on the um, response and if we can give anything special to you we will do our best to serve you so that's it bye and thanks for watching and hope to see you guys soon